Hey guys, welcome back to the Beehive. Long time new see. I think I always start them off that way now. Pepper's gonna play with a pencil in the background, just so you know. That's what she's doing. <laughs> she's got it stuck underneath the stove. Um, happy Easter, because I'm gonna post this on Easter day. Um, I couldn't post it any sooner because my kids would probably watch this and I didn't want them to see it. But today we are going to show you what I put in their Easter baskets. Now, if you guys are new to the channel, I have three kids. Um, Brooke, she's 18, Blake, he's 16, and Ben, he is 11. But I have to say a big thank you to Kessie because they sent me a pretty awesome care package to share with you guys. Um, they sent this to us for free and I'm going to incorporate it in their... Easter goodies, if you will. So, and I do know that you can find these things in the store now because we were out at Walmart and I saw these and I was like, oh look, that's what we have at home. So I will leave a link in the description below. Uh, Pepper is really excited too. So let's get into it. Let's see what we got. Oh, can you guys see? Look at this. Awesome. Oh, we got lots and lots of hula hoops. Who can hula hoop? Let me know in the comments if we have them. Looks like we got one for everybody in the family. How fun. And these are like V-shaped. We'll give Ben the small one. V grip and it grips to your hips. That's what I would probably need. And then we got these. Look how cool these are. These are real tiny and Pepper ends up grabbing these because they're just her size too. So not only good for kids, you guys, good for pets too. <laughs> no. Um, yeah, the, the, you can bounce these. These bounce like really high and they're cool because when they have these little nubs on them, they don't always bounce straight up and down. They kind of jump in crazy directions, which is kind of cool. So these are the mini drop dots. So we're playing with those. And then we got, oh, look at this, a football. That's super cool, a football. And I love, this is my personal favorite. We got a soccer ball. Pretty cool. And then four more drop dots. I'm gonna put these here on the counter with their Easter baskets so when they come down, they can choose which ones they want. But these are a lot of fun in the pool too. We um we play with these in the pool. That's a lot of fun. And they're easy to grip because they kind of have like a, I don't know, it's like a rubbery texture. And then it's spiky too, but it's really soft too. So yeah, check the link in the description, but let me go ahead and show you what is in their Easter baskets. All right, so here are their baskets. I just love them. I don't even remember where I got them, but I just love them. They're like uh, wooden type style baskets. Anyways, um, this is Brooke's basket. And as you can see, everybody got some money, right? But what I do with their baskets is I usually do a couple of their favorite like chips and crackers. And she really likes the buffalo um, wing Cheez-Its and then the flaming hot cheetos and then i'll do some candy that they like and her favorites are the starburst and of course you gotta get the pink only because those are her favorite and then i got some of the uh sour patch sour candy things she also likes the airheads extremes and then i put a few other things in here usually not too much because they're not really big candy eaters but i do put some of their favorites in there I always get these every year. I think they're kind of cute. And then um, some little Twizzlers and some little, what do you call these, sweet tarts? Yeah, sweet tarts. And then she does not like milk chocolate. So <laughs> every year I always have to find like a dark chocolate bunny. And this year I found one by Dove. And then um, let's see what else do we got in here. Oh, yeah. And then I always get a pack of gum for them as well. And she likes the... That, uh, was it five gum, cobalt, cobalt, peppermint. And then down here we got some bubble gum. And that's about it for her basket. And yeah, just something to say happy Easter, you know? All right, let's move on to Blake's. Now, Blake loves Funyuns, so I got him some Funyuns. And they love goldfish, so I got some goldfish and then... He does not like the sour gums, like the peppermint and and the uh, cinnamon and things like that. He's more of a fruity tasting kind of person. So I got him the Juicy Fruit Fruit Explosions, I guess it is. Juicy Fruit Collisions. So that should be fun. And 
again, I put this in all their baskets because it's usually like a pack of, you know, three or four. And then I just split them up between the three of them. And then I also got him the fruit chews that are, you know, sweet and tasty. And then they love the airheads and they also love Cadbury eggs. As you can see, I got those. But I saw these this year and I wanted to try them. These are the Oreo Cadbury eggs, which I thought would be kind of fun. And then, <laughs> the, as you can see, Brooke had this in hers, the little stickers. So I just put that in there. I think it came with the, um, I don't know what it came with, to be honest with you. Pepper just knocked over the box. It was one of these things that it came with. <laughs> so anyways, then I also got, um, well, Charlie picked this out, the Twix eggs. Uh, because they're not really, we, we always get the Easter Bunny eggs, you know, the chocolate bunnies, and they just never seem to eat them. Um, so we got the Twix eggs, which we thought, you know what, Twix are good, so let's give that a try. And then moving on to Ben's basket. Now his basket's got a little bit more in there, you know, he's a little bit younger. And so I do a little bit extra for him usually. usually. And so yeah, he got his chips and he loves salt and vinegar. He got this little thing, it's like a push pop topper thing and then he got the Twix bar as well and he also got goldfish and he loves this is his favorite ice cream he likes mint chocolate chips so I said I'm gonna try the mint chocolate chip gum to see if he likes it hopefully he will <laughs> and then we got the Tootsie Rolls for him and we got some Sour Patch for him as well and then also I found this Easter grass bubble gum which I thought would be kind of fun and then in here, he's also got the Cadbury Egg Minis and, you know, the Oreo Egg and some Sweet Tarts and Twizzlers. And then he got his money as well. So, yeah, we just kind of try to keep it simple. Um, it's going to be different this year. Usually we go to my friend's house, uh, Jessica, to do an Easter egg um, hunt. And we won't be doing that this year, unfortunately. But that's okay. We're going to make the best of it at home. Brooke um, actually has to work today, so she's going to be going into work. Pepper's in that huge box. But I also wanted to show you guys new um, Brooke and Cameron. I went ahead and got him a little something for Easter as well. He loves the Buffalo Cheez-Its as well, so he got those. But let me show you. I had this little basket laying around. It's just like a dollar store basket, you know. And I got him the Hot Cheetos. He likes those. And I got him a milk chocolate bunny. I hope he likes it. He got airheads, sweet tarts, ring pops. Uh, he also got like the gum and then the sour patch, of course, and the Oreo. Just something to say happy Easter. I see you're probably wondering why I don't have like the traditional like jelly beans and peeps. My kids do not like those so. You know, I used to buy them and put them in their basket just because it just felt like Easter, and I just don't do that no more. Um, they don't eat them, and if they did, they usually would take like one bite of the peep and be like, oh yeah, that's right, I don't like it. <laughs> so, if comments are on, you guys let me know in the comments below if you guys like peeps or jelly beans. Now, I will say the jelly bellies are probably one of our favorites, like if we had to choose and, you know, something that the kids would eat. But I don't think I saw those. I knew they do have them, though. I just didn't see them in the store. But yeah, that's going to do it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much, Kess, for sending these toys over to us. We're going to have a lot of fun with them in the pool, um, hula hooping in the driveway. It just gives us something to do while we are, you know, not able to go anywhere right now. So yeah, thank you so much for that. And you guys come back tomorrow because I will film our Easter day. And I will post that video for you guys tomorrow with the kids' reactions from their Easter baskets. All right, that's going to do it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to subscribe if you're new and don't forget to buzz that like button. See you guys tomorrow.